Okay, so we're trading the economic news uh, this afternoon. The report, the U.S. advanced retail sales is due out at 12.30 GMT time, which is 1.30 UK time, which is in about two minutes. So in preparation for the report coming out in about two minutes, we're having a look at the chart. We're going to start with the euro US dollar. And as we can see, the US, euro US dollar has been trending sideways. This tends to be the case before reports of high importance come out. The market tends to trend sideways prior to the report of importance coming out. Now remember the word is it tends to. There's no always or never in trading. So it just tends to trend sideways. Now we can see here that the high of the sideways trend is at that point, 12.910. And the low of the sideways trend is just there, which is just above the pivot point. So we've got the pivot point there and the high of the sideways trend. So we're going to have two pending orders in preparation of the report coming out. We're going to have a sell order just below the pivot point to sell at 12824 and a buy order just above the high of the day at 12912. So it's now 1.30, so the report has come out. So we'll now see what happens. So again, if the market goes up, we'll be happy to buy just above the high of the day there. And if it starts crashing down, we'll sell just below the pivot point. Just make it bigger. There we are. And then for the pound dollar, we can see the pound dollar has been going sideways. We've established the support for the market at 15.344. So we'll be happy to sell if it breaks the support of the market at 15.342. And if it breaks the first resistance using the pivot point strategy, we'll be happy to buy there. In the meantime, we'll wait and see how the pound dollar reacts to the market, uh, to react to the report just been released to decide if we need to change our initial plan. But for now, we'll wait and see. So we can see the market is beginning to advance. But you'll soon find out with most uh, economic reports, the market can initially go up on the release of the report. And once traders have been able to digest the report, they will then, they could then push the market back down. So it can be, uh, you can get wild swings in the market and wild changes in the market in response to the report. So the fact that the market responds one way prior to the report coming out. It doesn't mean it's going to stay that way. It could just change its direction at any time. So uh, if nothing is uh, set in stone, you just have to wait and see. It usually takes about five to ten minutes for the market to then settle down and decide which way it's going to go.